you've never watched my channel, one, let me know in the comments. And two, this is a farming channel that you've stumbled across. We do a daily blog of life on this beef and arable farm here in South Yorkshire. Yesterday, it seemed to be that I was in the lorry, not the scanner, the daff, all day. Now today, hopefully it's going to be a little bit different. Um, okay. By the looks of it, I don't know if you can see in the background there, looks like we've got some cows out in the yard. They're not supposed to be there. I'll get the shed opened up and uh, we'll find out where these have come from. Well, those gates there look closed. These ones look closed. Hmm, I'm starting to wonder, maybe they've come out of Stanley's. Yeah, it looks like they've come out of down there. Somebody's not put the locking chain on. You've all made a bit of a mess, haven't you, while you've been out? Come on, softy. Come on. Come on, let's have you up. Yeah, so it's this gate here. So if, they, if they push on it and rub on it, it pops it out, so we always put this chain on. But um, that chain's not being put on. Well, I'll leave them in this outside area because it'll be quite difficult for me to push them in on my own. I can just see everything escaping back out. Start feeding round and wait for Andy to come, and then we'll get him back in. So right now I'm just putting out a bit of straw until Andy uh, turns up. I'm here a bit early today. Just get this put out. Mucky windows, aren't I? Morning, Andy. Mm. Made a mess, aren't I? Stanley. Yeah. Limp container. I know, that's what I'm thinking. I'll blame Ben. <laughs> So we're getting these guys back in their pen now. Come on, get on, that's it. Right, so I'm gonna leave Andy to that. And I'm gonna jump on the TM. Start feeding round. So now I'm just feeding out with the MX bucket. These guys are hungry. They're all fairly new ones. My turn now to let Andy in some pens. You're not supposed to stay there. Come on. Big softy, aren't you? Come here then. Come on. As I've come back to the house, we've had a bit of a merchandise delivery. So we've got new hats. They're going to be coming into stock soon if people like them. What I'll probably do actually is I'll put them on the website tonight and then um, you'll be able to order them. And then I'll probably place an order on I don't know, Friday or something. Um, and then in maybe a week or so, we'll get, or two weeks from then probably actually, because I'll have to order them. You'll have to send them. To, yeah, yeah. So yeah, you can pre-order them basically. We've also got this navy polo shirt. So people ask for a different colour and here you go. There's a different one. Navy polo shirt. Hang on a minute. Go with it, the navy hoodie. It's nice this, I like it. I'm gonna wear this today actually. Well, I'm gonna wear both of them today. I'm a new hat. Um, so yeah, if you wanna um, check them out and if you like want to order a, maybe a, one of the sizes that isn't so popular, I'll put everything on stock on the website but it's, it's not in stock. I'll just order it um, when I've got the orders through. So um, they're all going to be on there tonight. So check it out. Hopefully it might pay for Becky's flooring as well, which is, uh, you know, an extra bonus. So we are all off. We're off, mate. Oh my God, why are you shouting? Sorry. We're shouting then, mate. Sorry. You all right? Yeah. Yeah, good. Um, you all right? <laughs> why? What's the matter? <laughs> Trying to prepare myself <laughs> <laughs> to be crying or cross. I'm a tight farmer, alright? Tight's not the word, Joe. Yeah. Raccoon can climb. Raccoon can climb, can he? Right, we're gonna climb out the car then. We're gonna try this place first Wilson's carpets. Well, there's lots of carpets in here, isn't there? Oh, what are you doing? Oh. Looking at carpets.
What colour do you want them? A light colour, beige. Oh, love the carpets. Fetch you to now, eh? The golden arches. Happy meal. Do you want some of this? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. To another carpet place now. And Becky's just told everybody on TikTok about the hole in our roof. It's a good hole, isn't it? Not really, no. <laughs> I'll put it up now and then you can see it. So basically, like, part of the chimney at the top, the uh, cement or mortar or whatever, has fallen onto some of the tiles and then that's cracked one of the, no, two of the tiles. So our roof man's supposed to be coming, but he's a bit, like, lackadaisical. Our roof man? What? Who he's not rang? I have rang him! It's only just happened. Well, we don't know that. We do. We don't. Well, it weren't there you before. wouldn't have known. Well, you wouldn't have known it was a damp room until the painters told us. Oh. I don't think people are interested in this. Anyway, the debate. I think it's just happened with the strong winds. <laughs> going to look at the carpets. Anyway, do you want some? Joe's going to buy me a carpet. Let's go. Let's go. In United Carpets and Beds now. Mummy. He's getting bored of carpet shopping now, aren't you, mate? Yeah. yeah. What's the matter, mate? What, what's the matter with it? It, it doesn't have a name, it? It doesn't? How does it feel? I don't know. Does it make you feel sad? You just said. Because <laughs> it's not got a number but on it, that's that why. I'm back in the yard now. Andy's gone to get his um, wheels fixed on his car. And it looks like Ben's, I'm guessing, doing a mix. Nice. I'm back in my scruffs. Um, ready to do a bit more work with Ben. Hopefully do some feeding up with him. And um, yeah, just finish the day off. Ben's not been able to <laughs> undo the locking pins. Go on, Charles, have a look then. It's because Andy it flicks this thing over. It, and it's not very easy to find. So let me show people on no, the YouTube. Down there, look, there's a locked one and that was flicked. No, that, that, that just locks your crowd. It's this one here. With it open. I, know, I know which one you mean now, but I just never thought down. that would be a... It's obviously auxiliary. It's for the auxiliary. So and basically the up and down is so that it operates you want to put the pickup pitch at the back there. So you can either operate the pickup pitch or you can lock the pins for the bucket. Now the pins that I'm on about here, these things here, the locking pins that keep it on. So yeah, it confuses people. And this clicks it so that it doesn't accidentally press it with the um, on the joystick. And Andy have already done the pens, so he's going to finish off on the TM now. And I will jump on the nine meter that we've just been on about, and I'll put the fodder beat around just to make the job a bit quicker. They're happy in that, aren't they? I like it. Ben's on it there. I'm having to sort of go around and be after Ben, so I'm uh, just looking for places where I can put it where there's uh, the meal's already been put down. So, up the path is one of them places. Because if I was to put the fodder beat underneath the feed that Ben's putting on top, then the cows would sort through all the feed, throw it all over with the noses to get to the fodder beat. So, um, yeah, I've got to put it on top and then they'll just be able to get it straight away because that's what I want to find. It's like the little nuggets of chocolate for them, full of sugar. Love it. But I've just started chopping in here. The cows have heard it. The majority were laid down. Look at them all. Like that's worth getting up for. They're all coming, lad. This one. Running through it. Running for it. You like it, eh, guys? Don't you? Like that about the nine meter. You can just keep pushing the boom now. And it keeps working. I want to do this next bit, Ben. Okay. It's time for mix dimensions. Now, on today's we've got Thomas Darbison, who's eight. Going up the ages, we've got Guy Maynard, who's 22. He's from Devon as well, from Andy's country. And then, sorry Ben, you're the oldest today. Ben Davies at the Big 4-0. -oh. 
So we've raised £4,187 um, so far, which is absolutely fantastic. Like it's a mission, maybe nearly two missions, I think, for the air ambulance, which, which is just great. Above what I thought was uh, achievable. If anybody wants to be involved in that, there's a link in the description below and the money goes straight to the charity. Straight there. Doesn't touch me at all. And Ben doesn't get his hands on it either. So I thought you were going to come and chuck that at me then. Um, right. We're going to start putting machines away and start packing the job up. Everything's in the shed now. Um, Ben's off to check on an effort that's about to carve at um, the place where he works. And yeah, I've got to wait for my dad to get back from first. So I might just do some pottering about around here. I might chop some logs up or something like that. If you have liked today's video, remember to press the like button. Uh, subscribe if you've not already. And if anybody wants any of that merchandise, like I said, I will order it on Friday. So if you want to get in the uh, odd, odd sizes and then on Friday, I'll just order a, a load of different sizes that I think uh, fit most people. I'll shut the watch. So at the minute, right, okay, right, let's go into this. At the minute, everything is classed as being in stock. So if you were like a, um, one of the sizes that isn't popular, let's say, then you can order it and then I'll order it on Friday and then you get it. But what I will do on Friday is probably order just the popular sizes that we usually sell. Um, so the unpopular ones won't be in stock from Friday. So if you know what I mean, then I hope you do. <laughs> anyway, I'm going, I'm going. Ben's gone, he's walked off and um, yeah, I've got stuff to do. So thanks for watching guys. Big Mick and the evening night out. I think I'm going to upload that tonight because I sort of edited it a little bit. It's a bit haphazard how I put it together, but um, you'll get the gist watching it. Enjoy. See you. Bye.